It's Selena dipping in the lady pond with Cara Delevingne. Are Queen B and Jay-Z calling it quits as soon as their tour is over? All this and more on Rumor Patrol. What's up, you guys? Happy Saturday and welcome back to Rumor Patrol, where we are here to debunk all this scandalous stuff going on this week. I'm Miriam. Misty isn't here, but in her place, we have the awesome Kingsley. Thanks for having me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Kingsley, I know you really wanted to talk about rumor number one. This one's crazy, you guys. Let's hear it. The, okay, the rumor is, is Selena actually getting it on with the beautiful supermodel Cara Delevingne? Oh my goodness. I know, this one's crazy, but it's based on a picture that it was taken of the two of them in Saint Tropez. Okay, cause check it you guys. Selena decides to spend her 22nd birthday in Saint Tropez okay. with Cara Delevingne. They're having all these crazy adventures and some other really hot European guy that she's been photographed with. But there's this one picture where her and Kara are almost sharing um, a beach chair and they're almost kind of cuddly and Selena is all sensual looking at the cara camera, but Kara is just looking up at Selena like there's a little love in the air. I don't know, what do you think? Oh my gosh, I think this is a little scandalous. I would never Definitely. expect this from Selena Gomez, but you know, the 20s is that time where some ladies start experimenting with some things. This is true, I, I, I don't know anything about that, but <laughs> I've heard that other people have done that in their 20s. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> I actually think they would make a really adorable couple. Do you? I do. I don't know. For Kara, I'd be looking out because, you know, Selena has all that baggage with Aww. Justin Bieber. You were so, keeping it so real, Kingsley. I'm hella keeping it real. I'm looking out for her. I don't want her, you know, thinking she's getting into Aww, some committed... Something serious? Yeah. Like, no, girl, this is a fling. You're right. It's a rebound, a lesbianic rebound. <sighs> but, but, again, is this really true? On the flip side, she's been photographed also in Saint Tropez with this super hot guy whose name is Tommaso Chiabra. Even oh. the name just makes me want to drool. I know, right? That foreign right? type of sound just rolling off your Say tongue. It. Tommaso. Oh, that's Ugh. good. That's good. Well, I don't think that she'd be hooking up with two people in the same trip, in the same hotel, so, and it looks like she's definitely hooking up with Mr. So. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Good, Kingsley. So, I, I, personally, I think in conclusion, this rumor is totally false. false. We agreed. Yeah, I for sure. I agree. Now moving on to rumor number two. Are Jay-Z and Beyonce calling it quits after they're on the run tour? No. That would be awful. That would be awful. A lot of people are speculating that there's actually a lot of tension behind the scenes and that the entire tour and their relationship as of late is all for show because they don't know at this point how to turn back time and how to handle the public perception mm. if they were to get a divorce. Very so they're trying true. to figure out how to hide their problems and separate without it being public knowledge. You know what? It's like that Sprite ad, image is nothing. Thirst is everything. Okay, it has nothing to do with the Sprite ad, but image is nothing. And I think that they for so long have been seen as this perfect yep. in love power couple and things are not always what they look like. Obviously there's some drama there. They're both super smart business mm -hmm. people. So, oh God. I don't know what's going on with them, but it makes me question everything. I know, it's get a sad when you see a couple like that, and I feel like ever since the elevator video mm -hmm. leaked, mm -hmm. people have been like just looking for cracks and cracks yes. and signs that something yes. is wrong with them. So do you think that there were probably issues way before the elevator, we just didn't know about it? Of course, I mean, like you said, they're both smart business people. I think they're one of those couples that know how to put their image into the public eye how they want it to be because I mean a good couple you never argue in public even yeah. with like your friends you put that behind closed doors right. I think they've done a good job of that until recently so do you think that love will prevail here or more importantly do you think that money will prevail here and they'll stay together just because it makes sense uh, Literally. I hope sense. that love prevails. Mm. I hope that if they're together, that they are really together for yeah. themselves, for baby blue, and that there's nothing serious going on. I love them. The end of the day, this is all speculation. Aside from the elevator incident, we don't really have any real evidence here. Nope, none at all. So you know what? How about we just give them a little bit of faith and uh, wish the rest of their tour some luck. And why don't we conclude that this rumor is hopefully boss. Maybe. Hello, boss. Sorry. Oh, ooh, some doubt with you. I'm sorry. Oh, God.
All right, you guys, our favorite segment. All of your rumors on display right now, and why don't you start the first one? All righty. Marco Pollock wants to know, is it true that Kim Kardashian worked as some kind of a maid for Paris Hilton before her fame, and that she used to massage, or however that's spelled, <laughs> Paris's feet? I heard it on TV that some tabloids were saying that. I was wondering if it was true. Hope you answer, love your channel, and thank you for always keeping us all up with the crazy world of celebrities. That's really adorable. That is. Do you know the answer to this one? It's so true. It's definitely what? true. She no. didn't used to be a maid, but no. she organized Paris Hilton's closet. But that doesn't make you a maid. Of course I, not. I have organized my friends' closets. That does not make me anything like a maid. That's true. I just like calling Kim you Kardashian just like, a maid. Okay, you know what? I agree with you. Actually, <laughs> I like that. Yes, it is true. She was her maid. She started from the bottom, and now she's on top. Oh. <laughs> Actually, no. Also, um, I think she used to work as her makeup artist, as Paris's makeup artist. When you Google pictures of Kim from like back in the yeah. day, she's usually described as Kimberly Kardashian, Paris Hilton's makeup artist. So I think this rumor is actually kind of true. Sort of true. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, Maudia Matthews, did Selena Gomez get a boob job for Justin Bieber? By the way, I love you and I love you back. Um, this rumor has also been rampant. All right, so recently, Selly Cell had a picture taken of her. She wasn't wearing a bra and yep, the breastuses were like up to her chin. But that is what <laughs> happens when they bounce and someone takes a picture as they're bouncing up. That's what, what I happens. said. Everyone's trying to act like right. she's just standing there, like it's yeah. just some candid picture. Like, no, yeah, she's it was clearly. Like motion. Yeah. Like this. Come on, people. Yeah, come on, people. So this rumor is totally false. Kista Nicknam wants to know, is Michelle Obama <laughs> divorcing Barack Obama? I saw some pictures in magazines, but sometimes you can't trust magazines. Please answer my question. I've been asking for weeks. I was shocked when I saw this one, and Christy, you were not the only one. A lot of you wanted to know about Michelle and Obama. Seriously? Or Michelle and Barack. Yeah. What's I know. Is there Bring a problem? politics into rumor control. <laughs> Um, I didn't even know about this, did Me you? Me neither. I actually read a tabloid piece like a few months ago that Beyonce was having an affair with oh, Barack Obama, my which God. is just completely ridiculous. That is obviously. absolutely false, obviously. Uh, I haven't heard anything about Michelle and Barack, and here's what I have to say about political couples. If the Clintons managed to stay together <laughs> after the blue dress, and for all y'all that are too young to know about the blue dress, wiki, ah. look it up then these two are never, ever, ever getting divorced, I think. Taylor Swift remix. Right? Never, Outside. ever, ever getting divorced. <laughs> so that means this rumor is totally false. Oh. And last but not least, Ashley Cruz. Is it true that Miley Cyrus passed away from drugs? Hashtag rumor patrol. Not yet. <laughs> and I hope never. <laughs> I'm sorry. And I don't mean it as a joke, kind of. Uh, Y'all know that Miley does some drugs. Uh -huh. I don't know what exactly, aside from the one that rhymes with her name. Um, I would like to see her do less drugs. True, you know, hopefully she survives as she is still breathing. You know, her tongue is just as active <laughs> as it has been any other day. Exactly. She's totally alive, y'all. You just need to go on Instagram. I've been saying y'all so much lately. Have you really? I thought yes. you were just doing like a little Miley, like y'all. Does but she it's do? Part of your... She says like a Southern y'all. Yeah, 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 mine's like a Miami y'all. I like it. Thank you. Go with it. I'll keep it then. All right, you guys. So this rumor, fortunately, is totally false. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Rumor Patrol and letting me fill in today. Thank you so much I for love being that. here. Thanks. You are awesome. Make sure you check us out on Twitter. That's My Twitter right. is Kingsley with three Ys. That's a lot of Ys. It is. And mine is Miriam Issa with no Ys. And uh, make sure you leave your rumors on the bottom of this video so that maybe next week we will use yours on Rumor Patrol. See you guys next Saturday. Bye. You guys know Rumor Patrol is the only place to have your rumors debunked, so make sure you check out last week's episode and subscribe to Clever News while you're at it.